Good morning guys, how are you all doing? Monday the 21st of November Less than 35 hours since I last finished work, I'm back at work again uh, I had to reduce my daily, reduce my weekly rest this week So, it's uh, 10 past 4 in the morning, I've been up since my son woke me up about quarter past 1 uh, I had to be at the yard around about half two anyway, so I just stayed up. So we're uh, all hooked up now, all set up on the way down to Swindon. And I'm in a Scania! Woo -hoo! Uh, not much, uh, not much first impressions really for you all, but all I can say so far is the driving position's a lot more it feels a lot more upright than in the Volvo the pedals feel further in towards me I mean I know I'm in a different position altogether seating but the, the pedals feel further towards me um, the dashboard feels more upright and the, the mirrors are a lot different I prefer the Volvo to be honest. Um, it took me quite a while to get accustomed to all the buttons. The layout is so much different to the uh, Volvo. Just let this guy back in with his logs. Damn. Uh, yeah, so the. Uh, I didn't realise, but the M60 shut junction 10 to 8. So, I think I'm going to take a detour through Wolverhampton because uh, I'm not sure, I'm not messing around with my phone and that today at all. I just need to carry on and get there. So I'm just going to cut through Wolverhampton to miss out the majority of the diversions. I mean, I know it's only four o'clock in the morning, so it's not going to be majorly busy. But I've seen road clo I've seen motorway closures along the M6 before, and no matter what time of day it is, it can still congest the area up. So uh, yeah, I had hope you all had a great weekend. I had half of a weekend, and after we'd been shopping, had some dinner. That was pretty much it. <laughs> uh, my best mate Gaz came round and we had a good afternoon, like chilling out and having a laugh. But um, yeah, it was over far too soon. So we're heading down to Swindon now. I've got a reload in Lempster and then back up to the yard. So it's not, not a major day today because I think they're planning on sending me back up north to Scotland tomorrow. Well, guys, I've unloaded in Swindon uh, there was two different kinds of load I got chilled and ambient so I had to do eight pallets on the one bay and go round and do another 23 on another bay uh, unfortunately they've rejected one of the pallets uh, it looks like they've damaged it as they've loaded it on the trailer so I've got that back on board um, I'm just having me 30 minutes now to clear me drive time uh, me something to eat and a drink. Uh, I want to shout out Ernest. Welcome to the channel, buddy. Thank you for subscribing, and I hope you enjoy your stay. Uh, don't forget the Facebook ch channel, Facebook page, I mean. So yeah, I'm just on the A417, and it's piddling down me rain. Uh, I forgot to tell you, it's a brand new Scania that I'm in. Uh, it's just done 55,000 kilometres, so it's a very nice piece of kit. Uh, it's, I think it's slightly less luxurious than the Volvo I was in. I must admit I prefer the Volvo actually, but I'm not going to complain. They're all, they're all awesome trucks. Uh, it took me a while to get associated with all the buttons and everything because the symbols all seem a bit slightly different to what I'm used to but uh, you know 
I'm a fast learner. Catch you in a bit. Well, guys, that's me done for today. Um, I tipped and then I reloaded in Lempster. And I've come back through via Kidderminster and I'm back at the yard now. Uh, sorry, I haven't done much recording today. I've had a real busy day and um, a lot of stuff on my mind at the moment, to be fair. So I ain't, I ain't had a chance to record much for you all. So, uh, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll catch you all tomorrow.